Hey all you cool cats and welcome back to another episode of Dongaroba Ultra Despair Girls. We are inside the hotel right now. I'm trying to cut through it. I'm trying not to miss anything. Uh, a bunch of people asked that I was really, really cautious and not missing any of the extras. Um, so I've I've been doing my best to really look around. I don't have a strategy guide, so it's just it's just me gonna be trying very, very cautious with not missing anything. Um, the Unstoppable Man. Triathlon, boxing, rock climbing, Sabu Karen tackles them all non-stop. What's his newest challenge? What is the reason why he doesn't give up? And what is the single scene that will finally make him stop? If you're, if you start reading, you won't stop either. Sabu Karen's autobiography, unabridged masterpiece edition. Hmm. Unstoppable. There's no way I'd be able to do it. I'm getting pretty tired. <sighs> You think you're tired? If you're tired, you don't even have the word of how tired I am. I need a new onomatopoeia to express the sheer tiredness. <gasps> you're tired? You don't really look like it, Toko. Isn't that obvious? I'm a literal arts to the core. No energy at all. Don't mess with me! Aren't you younger than me? Telling me you're tired already. Uh -huh. My age doesn't affect how tired I am. Which reminds me... Oh, hey, how old are you? Your tricks won't work on me! <gasps> what? You're trying to show how young you are by comparing yourself to my age, aren't you? Trying to add old hag onto the usual insults of ugly and gloomy and smelly. Oh. Th that's not true at all. I was just curious. <laughs> Doesn't matter. I won't tell you. You're hiding it makes me want to know even more, Toko. Makes me think that maybe you're even older than I imagined. Nothing. No way. I'm five or six years older than you. <laughs> no way you're younger than that either. Don't mess with me. I very well could be. <laughs> oh, Toko. Okay. I think I'm safe to go into this room. I'm scared of being, like, cut off from from examining things. <clears throat> the founding of Toa City. The predecessor to the corporation Toa Group was a small factory called Toa Ironworks, which first opened its doors 200 years ago. To Tokushige Toa, who became the first chairman of Toa Group, established Toa Ironworks entirely by himself. Because iron manufacturing was a new, blossoming industry, Toa Ironworks soon dominated 70% of the market. But Tokush... Tokushige Toa was not yet satisfied. He also had a hand in other business ventures, such as bamboo forests and foreign trade, and continued to show his strong will and brilliant business sense. Incredibly, from age 30 to his death at 64, he established a new business once every 20 days. Tokushige's wife, Tomoko Toa, had this to say about her husband. When I asked him why he always pushes himself, he would always say that it's for the sake of prosperity of mankind. Without Tokushige Toa's unflagging devotion to the advancement of mankind, neither Toa Group nor Toa City would exist today. I have a feeling that something's wrong with Toa Group. When you start talking up something in, in Danganronpa, something bad's gonna become of it. It's just, it's just the nature of things. I feel like there's like so much bloom going on. I feel like that's a trap. Monokuma oh my Kamehameha. god. Boy, did I- Whoa! <laughs> that shot! <sighs> now I'm nervous they're gonna pop out behind me. God, this camera. Stop it. Oh, I don't want to see blood. Yeah, well, me I don't think either. they have a choice. Okay, why would you let me go into a room with nothing in it? There has to be something here. Oh! The bomb inside her won. I, Yumi Kayakuda16, am a normal high school girl in every way. At least, I wish that were the case. My womb is filled with bombs, so if I ever fall in love, they'll, they'd explode. That's why ever since I was born, I've been pure and innocent, but then he appeared. Shota Honen, the boy who says he loves me. K 
Keeping my distance, less than lovers, more than friends, pushes me to my limit. Sorry, but if this goes on, I'm going to fall for you. So do something horrible to me. Lighting up a fire in your heart? A risky, thrilling love story? <laughs> what did I just read? This is it! What? Amazing! The bomb inside her! This manga! Oh, it's been ages since I read this! I love it! <sighs> it's just a manga! Why'd they draw her eyes so big? Jeez, at least I look remotely human. Togo! The size of the eyes, the sign of beauty! A sophisticated process of form! Well, she's actually upset. <laughs> a manga with small eyes is like ramen with no bamboo shoots! <laughs> Sounds like some pretty good ramen. Aww. Oh, have you even read it? The bomb insider is like required reading for high school girls. So vulgar. There's no way I'd read even a single page of that manga trick. What? What do you mean high school girls? Are you even in high school? Well, age-wise I am. Huh? Age-wise? You've been in prison since middle school? Is that your middle school uniform? No, this is a high school uniform. While I was in prison, it was delivered to me one day along with the food. Till then, I'd been wearing my middle school uniform. The culprit probably felt sorry for me. Hmm. Well, for criminals, that was a pretty nice gesture. A grown woman in a middle school uniform, people would have called the cops. <laughs> well, you're the one to talk wearing a high school uniform even though you've even after you've graduated. <laughs> but I'm really glad they gave me one. This is St. Koa Girls Academy uniform. It's a famous rich girl school. Koa? I've never even heard of it. Koa Academy has a 300 year history of culture, activities, and sports. The club uniforms are also super cute. There are tons of girls who want a chance to wear one. The school cafeteria is buffet style and you hear about it on the television all the time. What? I'm feeling it's just silly of me to fantasize about all those details now, isn't it? I see. Well, it sounded too good to be true, but you're telling me you've made up the whole thing? I wanted a high school life like that. But even if you weren't in prison, I don't think that school life was in your future. Stop it! Y you don't have to be so blunt about it. I... I guess there was a sparkle there, and I just didn't see it. Oh, that does not bode well if I can't pick up on sparkles. Alright. Be ultra vigilant for sparkles. Okay, no Monokuma. Hit list. Taka-a-kicks. Taka-a-kicks? Taka-a-kicks. I don't know. Um, real name. Taki Taki Taka 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 Taka-aki. Okay, Taka-aki Ishimaru. A demon who was a policeman in the demon world may be carrying the item gun, so be very careful when you hunt it. Also, its father is a super rare demon who's a former prime minister. Oh it oh oh that's that I didn't even look at the picture quite yet. It's Ishimaru's father? If you can hunt it down while leaving some body parts behind, your friends are going to be so jealous. Tickle its weak spot, the sides, then kill it when it starts laughing. Hunting ground, Science Memorial Hall. Oh, are we going to meet that guy? Um, what is this? Hit list? That doesn't sound good. But that's... The fizz the is... Did you remember something? You're right. Yeah, it's probably something the brats made. The list made so that they can officially hunt and kill targets like you. I impossible. But that's... Why would they do that? Take a look at this part. It says Hunting Grounds. With a stupid title, Hit List. It's gotta be those brats. We made so this. cool. But does that mean there are other people who are being hunted by the children? Nothing. I'm not sure, but that does seem likely. But why would something like You're this... Right. Well, I doubt they're passing this list around to the adults, so some brat must have dropped it. Um, if that's the case, we have to hurry and tell this person. The children know where they are. No. Your life is more important than that right now. I understand how you feel, but we have to go on. If we run into them, we'll let them know then. 
that's how we have to handle this for now. And honestly, I think every adult is worried for their lives. We don't need to go out of the way to let them know that they're being hunted. We're all being hunted. It, impossible. It, is that really okay? Anyways. Don't think of it in the terms of good or bad. It is what it is. I see. I see. It is what it is. I mean, right? Let's be real here. He, he can't be like, well, I didn't realize I was being hunted. No, we're all being hunted. I think I, I think I checked everything. All right, let's go down. Despite, you know, despite everything, this elevator still works. I don't need a heart. Oh, I hear Monokuma footprints. Footsteps, I mean. Where are these Monokumas coming from? I am running lower on bullets, so that doesn't There's alarm me. There's an arcade me. machine over there. Okay, what's up? If we use that bomb one, maybe we can get them all in one go. Destroy them all with one explosion. Tutorial time. The last room's requirement was to get past without getting caught, but from now on, arcade machines room's clear requirements will be kill all enemies. After destroying all the enemies, the wall in your way will disappear so you can move on. All the arcade machine rooms have strategies that can destroy all the enemies at once. This one is made to clear one shot by sniping Bomber Monokuma at the right spot. Of course, you could just clear them all with Genocide Jack, but if you use it too much, it might affect how that being judges you. At the top left corner of the screen is a hint for clearing the room. Only use the ammo on the top right of the screen and that being will be impressed. Huh? Who is that being, you say? It's that being who loves you deeply. What? Well, anyways, I believe looking for the strategy is the. I bet I believe looking for the strategy is the best thing for you smart people to try. I almost forgot. If something happens and you feel like you're stuck, please choose retry from the menu. But using retry affects that being's review, so play wisely. What are you talking about? Yeah! <laughs> I don't see anything in this room. Okay, I think we're good. I think we're good. Pop out of the glass panes. Surprising, I thought you would. There's a kid here. <laughs> what is this? A letter? Maybe it's a love letter. This might be the last <laughs> one you ever receive, so open it. You don't have to make it sound so ominous. Challenge. If you want to know the password, try asking the upside down bird. If you want to know the password, try asking the upside down bird? What the f Looks like they want us to solve a riddle. We put the right answer in here. What, what the heck? This is 
is no time to be playing games like this. What is the upside down bird? I want to slap this brat in the face for this. Monokumas would ambush us if I did. It's a pain in the ass, but we gotta do it. Then leave it to me. This kid's riddle will be child's play. <laughs> did, did you just make a pun? Wow, <laughs> that does not inspire confidence. Challenge start. There's an arcade machine over there. Maybe we should try using that. Oh, over there? Right. Oh, sparkle. Tobo Group's technical triumphs. Though the, the biggest, most awful, most tragic event in human history entrapped the entire world in despair, Toba City stood strong. It is often argued that the technical strength Toba Group prides itself on was a huge deterrent to the spread of despair. The mastermind behind the incident must have assumed that Toa City's technology technological superiority would be too much to defeat. Experts say that the influence of Toa Group is now so strong it could even be a deterrent against global warfare. Okay. What is this? No, picture it upside down. I feel like I've seen this trick before. the boss now <laughs> don't be gloating about beating a little kid That's the way to no like. Point in going this way. All right, all right. Very well then. Something happened to this. So cruel. Why do they do such cruel things? They probably don't have a real reason. From what I can tell, they're just doing it for fun. It's impossible. They're doing something like this for fun. What are these kids? You're right. When I got here, they're already wearing those helmets and marching in the streets, killing the adults and bringing Monokumas with them like a parade. Why do they hate the adults? Like I said, I have no idea. I'm just as confused as you are. Stop asking me about every little thing. Jeez, you don't have to be so angry. <sighs> it's because you nag just like those brats. If you move that electric car, you should be able to run over the Monokumas with it. Oh, shoot. Would that make them dead or broken? Well, doesn't matter. <laughs> oh, I love it. Oh, but I didn't get the coins for it. No, I wanted coins. Dang it, Toko. You cost me coins. I don't, I don't want to open these machines because I have a feeling I'm going to come back this way. I'm going to be able to collect, like, bullets that I've spent. Are you going to run off? Okay. Is this the wrong way or is this the right way? I want this to be the wrong way. Ha, sparkly. Electric up. 
Um, enemy paralysis time. Okay, well, I'm not using Toko at the moment, so I'm going to go ahead and add a, another H HP. I should probably switch to bullet mode because this is probably like a boss fight. Probably going to be a yes! boss fight right here. All we got to do now is cross the bridge. We did it, Toko. Just a little more. We're going to be all right. I wonder if it will really end this easily. Huh? I I have a bad feeling about this. This bridge has a, a dangerous scent. Yeah, it even has the two tone of like a monokuma. Hey! You just go over there. Oh, I thought it was like one of the kids. You guys don't look like you're with those kids. I thought it was like I thought it was one of those kids. Whoa, you look like a guy version of of Asahina. That means you're on my side, right? Right? Huh? Uh yeah. I knew it. Yes. Oh, this is fantastic. Man, it's been forever since I've seen a normal person. I'm so happy. I hate this kind of guy. Just walking up and talking to a girl like it was nothing. <laughs> uh, I think this handshake is over now. Hey, how much longer are you gonna hold her hand? You're like a creepy fan meeting an idol. Uh, no, it's not like that. It's just this wristband. Could it be? Were you also captured by those kids who call themselves the Warriors of Hope? Huh? And then you got thrown out here and told it was part of some game, right? Yeah, so... Does that mean... I'm guessing, like, he looks strikingly like Aoi's... Aoi's character. It, like, if I, like, just close out, like... Like, don't even look at the clothes or whatever and just kind of focus on only his face. That looks like so much like, uh, Owie, Owie that I'm like, I'm guessing maybe all of, maybe every single person that was in the, the first game had like some sort of relative that got, got put into like, you know, got captured and now is being forced to play this game, I'm guessing? Well, look, me too! Oh, that wristband! Oh, this is great! Well, not completely great. I'm already at my wit's end trying to figure out what to do. I guess I was just so relieved to see someone in the same spot I'm in. Still, could be better. I sort of understand. I'm also a little glad to know that I'm not alone in this situation. Right? Right? Oh, that reminds me. I never told you my name. <laughs> yep. I'm Yuta Asahina. All right, that that cinches it. <laughs> I'm Komaru Naegi. Nice to meet you, Yuda. Okay, Komaru Naegi. Yeah, Aoi did that as well, didn't she? She wrote she she wrote the name on on her hand to remember, right? I feel like she did. What are you doing? Oh, this. If you want to really remember a name, write it down on your palm three times. Oh, I see. I I've never heard of that. Oh, but seriously, it is so reassuring to finally have a friend to work together with. Oh, hey, by the way, who's this? She's been, um, glaring at me this whole time. Oh, uh, this is Toko. Toko Fukawa. It's fine. You don't have to make introductions like this. Not for an outcast like me. Listen to you two. Going on like you're lovers already. And you j just met. <laughs> he is cute. It, it's not like that. Well, come on. I'm sure we'd all be happier on that side of the bridge. Now let's hurry up and get out of this town. Toko, we should go too. What is it? Like I said, I, I don't like it. I have a very bad feeling about this. Uh, I have a bad feeling too. 
I'm with Toko on this. Anytime things are, are too good to be true in Danganronpa, it's honestly too good to be oh, true. You're just being paranoid. Come on, if we don't hurry, Yuta will leave us behind. Hey! Don't just run off! Hold on! Okay, let's make sure we don't miss any sparklies. This way, let's go! Yuda, slow down! So he's athletic too. Must be in the genes. But I, I just want you to know that I'm looking Hurry, diligently. This way! If we get across this bridge, we're outside Toa City. I'm sure those kids won't chase us. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. It was so easy to escape these kids. You know, there wouldn't be so many people dead. Also, for the number of cars here, I feel like... Like, why why abandon your car Once here? Once we're out of this town, let's celebrate by toasting with sports drinks. Yeah, I hope you're okay to be disappointed, because I'm pretty sure something's wrong with this bridge. Not a single sparkle this whole way. Wait, hold on. What's wrong? Oh, yep. Yep. Bridge is out. Are you kidding me? What's going on here? The bridge collapsed. N no. Isn't there something we can do? There's nothing we can do. It's impossible to get over the bridge now. Damn it, we were almost there. Stop screwing with us. What the hell is this? Hmm. How pathetic. Giving up right away just because things got a little screwed up. If you have the energy to shout and scream like that, use it to move your weak ass instead. Dang, Toko. Uh huh? Move? Just go back to the city. This part of the bridge might be unstable as well. Go back? You want us to actually go back there? <sighs> Well, this isn't gonna work. So what else? What what other option do we have? Yes, that's the only way. If you want to live, you can't always take the easy path. Sometimes you gotta take the painful ones. On that path, you might suffer and writhe in pain, but at least you'll survive. You say that as if you've experienced it before. <laughs> what? Uh oh. What the fudge? <laughs> See? Uh, we need to get off this bridge. If this keeps up, the whole bridge is gonna collapse. It's gonna be Monokuma's on the way. Yes, there is. Oh shit! We gotta run. It's gonna collapse. I know. I know. Damn it! They came out again. We're there. Calm down. Christ. I, I thought we were going to die. <laughs> we're safe for now. But with a bridge like this, there's no way we can get across. N now we have no chance of escape. No, not yet. I'm not going to give up yet. Why are you yelling? How do I explain it? Well, with all the despair I've felt so far, I've prepared myself. 
And if I don't do everything I can, I know that nothing's gonna get solved. What are you doing? Isn't it obvious? I'll swim! Oh, are you really gonna do it? What? Swim? I have a feeling they're gonna send Monokumas after him as soon as he goes, though. Yeah, I mean, my specialty is more track and field. I'm not that confident in swimming. Well, it's not that I'm not a good swimmer, it's just... There was always someone better. But now's not the time for that. Can't chicken out now! Wait! Even if you are gonna swim, it looks really far to the other side. I wonder if he's like, if he's almost the ultimate swimmer, but Ali's just, you know, better. Yeah, that looks pretty tiring. But the water is freezing, and with all the pollution, uh, there are weird creatures in there. Then I guess I'll just be extra careful. No, it's not that. I'm telling you not to try it, you idiot swimmer. D don't be a hero. Idiot swimmer? But I'm on the track team! <sighs> anyway, this isn't the time to rush into things. Let's think this out. I'm honored that you worry about me, but I've already made up my mind. So you're just going to refuse to listen to reason? Look, all I have to do is ask for help from those future Foundation guys after I cross, right? I'll bring back help, I promise, no matter what it takes. So just wait for me until then, okay? I don't know, man. Like, yo, if they already did this much to try and stop you before, I don't know if it's the best idea to just go swimming across there. They can probably track you with your band. Uh, Yuda? Hmm? Um, be careful. If you run into any trouble, come back right away, okay? Hey, no need to worry. I'll get to the other side any way I can. That's just making me more worried. This is the execution music, which has got me really worried. Oh no, it's even worse than I thought. It doesn't send Monokumas after you. It just blows you up. Oh, dude, we can't leave at all. Oh, no. There's probably a distance we can go. We have to shut down whatever's powering, like, whatever's monitoring these bands, Komaru. We can't just escape. What? N no. What's happening? Don't go... What do we do? We've got to hurry and save him! Yuta is- There's no way you can save him. He blew the F up. Are you serious? <laughs> what we just saw. Do you seriously think that it's possible for him to be alive after that? No. No. <laughs> you gain nothing from averting your eyes from reality. No matter how horrible or painful. Listen. We saw Yuta Asahina, and we saw that huge explosion. He's dead. He died. Oh, God. That sucks. Yuta died. <laughs> but why? Because Danganronpa is a very, very cruel, cruel place to anyone who seems like a good person. The reason doesn't matter. Even if we refuse to accept or understand it, it's the truth. That's reality. <laughs> you, you... Nothing's going to change, no matter how hard you cry. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, man. Let's be real here, though. She is taking this the way any... Any non-ultimate would, would react, I would say. Ultimates tend to behave in... In a very strange way to these situations. But she's kind of taking this the way... I guess a normal person would. Come on, that's enough. If you're done crying, we should get going. Plus, Toko's had enough experiences that, you know... She's been through a lot of painful and bad things already, so this is just like... Not to downplay what she's been through, but it's it's made her a stronger person. So... If we stay here, we're going to be an easy target for Monokuma's. Yeah, we need to get going. It's, it's impossible. Come on, Kamaro, you gotta move. Those Monokuma's will be coming for sure. Impossible? What are you talking about? If you just give up now, you're going to die. Well, I'm just gonna die anyway. Oh, man. I'm like you. I'm... I'm just some normal, regular girl. I... I can't even do anything! I mean, you've got that hacking gun, girl, so you're... you're a step up above them. No matter what I do, or how hard I try, I'm... I'm just gonna die here! So you're saying you're just giving up? Stop screwing around! I won't let you! You wanna die, huh? Well, if you really wanna die that much, I won't stop you. But... Are you really sure you want to die? You, you, you want to die right here? In this place? Not seeing your family or friends ever again? Are you really just gonna accept that? Of course not. I want... I want to see my family. But... But we've been separated for over a year. I don't even know where they are. It's probably too late anyway. I'll probably never see them again. <laughs> Can't you just be a little more positive instead of giving up right away all the time? No. You don't understand. The worst despair of all comes from having hope like that. I mean, I don't disagree with her. Having such strong hope and just losing it in an instant. Like what we just saw. So why don't you just overcome that despair as well? Because it's hard, Toko. Although I doubt you're even willing to listen in your state. If that's the case, at least run. You're saying that you're going to die anyway. So you're at least prepared, right? If you think you're going to die, at least run away. If you're wrong, you live. If you were right, then at least you die on the run. And not just standing here, suffering. Toko has some very good points here. It's probably just hard for Kamaru to hear it. Come on. Hi. Why do you bother trying to cheer someone like me up? Because she's invested in you, clearly. She tried to talk you to out of doing that. She had a bad feeling. I had a bad feeling. Like I said, I'm a member of Future Foundation, and I can't just abandon you. But if you keep up that sniveling and crying, I'll start to seriously consider it. There you go. Okay. I'll try. At least a little bit longer. Jeez, you're such a burden. You said to just run, but what are our options at this point? The bridge is a no-go, and there's no other way to get out of town, right? We don't know that. Did you forget what I just told you? You can't just give up right away. Anyway, now that I think about it, I remember a subway running through this town. A subway? Did the subway line go out of the city? Yeah, I think it did. You should have said that before! Well, sorry. I just remembered it right now. And besides, there's no way the trains work. You're right. If the power's out, they definitely won't be working. We're trapped. I think more importantly, we need to do something about these bands. I, I'm a little, I'm a little concerned. 
They, they must have some sort of distance. Like, once you get too far away, they blow you the F up. I don't think... I don't think it was just Yuta going into the ocean. I'm pretty sure it has, like, some sort of distance thing. Ugh, like I said, you can't give up so easily. Even if the train stopped working, we can get out of town if we just walk along the tracks. So don't give up. And let's go. I yeah. Okay. Well, I don't know if it's okay to say this, but I'll do it for Yuta's sake as well. Dang, poor Yuta. Poor Jeez, Allie. you're simple-minded. Getting all riled up from a half-assed speech like that. But the way Yuta died, there's no way I can just keep it secret from that idiot swimmer. Better not. Well, either way, first Master and I need to get out of this town. So, where's the subway? We didn't see it on the way over here. I, I'm not sure exactly. We'll just have to find it ourselves. Well, Toko, I'm starting to think that if we work together, we can find it for sure. Wow, what a bounce back. Stop wasting your breath on sentimental crap and let's get moving already. <laughs> Toko, let's get out of here together, okay? Why hasn't it, she told her about- It might be better if we go back to where we came out of that hotel before. We went straight for the bridge last time. <gasps> there should be a- It might collapse further. It's better if we don't get too close. I should be able to escape from the bridge. Ah, uh, seriously? This stuff makes no sense. Monokumas? To think that I finally released from imprisonment just to end up like this. Are these kids terrorists or something? Paradise? None of this makes any sense at all. I gotta get out of this town. First I'll head to the bridge. If it were my sister, I'm sure she would he dive head first into the ocean and swim right across. But I'm not as strong as swimmer. Anyway, to the bridge. I gotta make it across that bridge if I want to see my friends and family again. Ugh. Dang. 